this does not have that problem. You join me as I drink the world's worst iced coffee. I'm gonna switch off my mic because it's causing me a lot of problems. I say this every video, I really need to fix that. What do we have for you today? A Boohoo haul. Um, this is, I think, I've done two Boohoo hauls on my channel. This is the third and um, it is the best. It's the best that I've ever done. The stuff has really set me up for a spring transitional wardrobe, you know, still cold weather, moving into spring, some bright things. Um, I really like all of the stuff. So, without further ado, let's go. Oh, there will be a discount code. It'll be on the screen. My philosophy is put it in the box at checkout. If it works, it works. If it doesn't, it means there's another discount code on probably at that time. So, if it works, good for you. If it doesn't, there's probably another one. What have we got first? We've got this jumper. This jumper I got in a size small. I definitely should have gotten it in an extra small because I wanted it oversized, but it is a bit too oversized. You end up looking a bit like, um, you don't really know how to dress, but I still do really like it. And we love an oversized fit, so I don't mind too much. I quite like wearing it with uh, this little roll neck underneath. Roll neck? Roll neck? turtleneck whatever the hell it is this little white um layer underneath thinks that works really well with the v-neck um and i got that in a 10 actually sometimes i find boohoo bodysuits come up a little bit small um as i say every haul video i am five foot two and i tend to be between a six and an eight but i found with these you don't need them to be really tight so i just got that in a 10 fits better so maybe i'm a six to eight to ten Sizing doesn't really matter, to be honest, they're all just numbers. It just says baseball on it. Baseball, what does it say? Baseball champions. I am the baseball champion. I also got these jeans. I do currently have two bodysuits on, so I have the biggest wedgie in the world right now, so it feels a bit weird, but hopefully it all looks okay. These are actually really nice. They are quite a boot cut. Um, a little flared moment, which I'm really into at the minute. Um, I obviously did have to cut these short, took a good few inches off the bottom. You will know if you're a similar height to myself, that's really what you have to do. I don't take up jeans, I just cut them. I like a raw hem, you know? And um, yeah, I've never had any Boohoo jeans before. Got these in a size eight, absolutely perfect fit, even with two bodysuits on underneath. Why do I have two bodysuits on? Your question's as good as mine. Never had any Boohoo jeans before, would definitely get them again. Really lovely thick denim, no complaints. So jeans are always difficult and these are really good. If you follow me on Instagram, you will have already seen this coat. I have been looking for a jacket like this for literal years and I have never found one that fits me properly. This is a basic oversized biker jacket. I got this in the size small medium. Um, so it's like a slash and it actually fits me in the way that I wanted it to fit. This has honestly filled the gap in my wardrobe that I have been dying to fill. I have tried to buy these and have ended up buying and returning so many of them. I think I've had maybe three. One was too small and one was too big, uh, like too long, the fit was weird, all from different places. I got a couple from H&M, a couple from Misguided. This one has the actual fit that I want. This little thing at the bottom is a bit annoying. It tends to fall out, but I'm just gonna like um, sew it so it doesn't move. Uh, yeah, really, really like this. Honestly, as we've been in February and it's been, there's some days where it hasn't been as cold. I've been wearing this like layered with scarves and it's been so good. This is the type of thing, like my other like fitted biker jacket, you are just gonna keep in your wardrobe and take out year on year on year on year. They don't go out of fashion. So I've been looking for one for so long and now I have it. Have I worn another coat since? Maybe, but probably only once. <laughs> Next jacket. I saw this and I thought, I've got to have it. I've got to. Now I wouldn't wear it like this. Probably doesn't go very well with the blue jeans. But definitely with white roll neck is cute. A proper like varsity jacket with the like the faux leather sleeves and the little number and I love the little fluffy Borg collar with the little poppers. I think this is so cute. 
I've been looking at these jackets for a while now and I've just really wanted one and Boohoo have some great ones at the minute. So I got this in an eight. They describe it as a varsity bomber. Very High School Musical, very Grease, very American teen. I love it. I think with some like cream um, trousers, some, you know, maybe some joggers, like, like I said, probably not with these jeans. I mean, it's fine, but I wouldn't probably wear it like this. I love it. I just think it's so cute. Really kind of like vintage vibes. I like it. Another thing that I have been searching for, for so long, is a trench coat that isn't too long and has a nice back. And I feel that I may have done that with this. This Boohoo order, even my friends, when I sent them like pictures of what I got, they were like, this is an incredible order of clothes because you have filled wardrobe gaps that you have been trying. Okay, very sorry, the card ran out. Trench coat. Have been looking for a trench coat with a nice back that is not too long for so long. I wanted to get a cream one, but I saw this and I just thought, oh, how are you? Would you like to come to my wardrobe? And it said, yes. Yes, I would. I've just realised that my sock has a hole in it, so my, my toe has been poking out whenever I've done full length shots. I don't know if you can see that or not, but listen, you're getting what you're going to get. So, this trench coat. Oh my goodness. Can we just take a minute for this? First of all, it is lovely quality. I don't know if this is from the Boohoo Recycled range. I do have something from the Boohoo Recycled range, a couple of bits. But... Um, the feel of this is so, so nice. Just double checked, I did get this in a size eight. Um, I really like an oversized fit of a trench and I think that this has done that quite nicely. Sometimes I would be tempted to size up to like a 10 or something, but I can't remember if this said it was an oversized fit or not on the website, but it definitely is a nice fit. There's a few things with trench coats that I feel that can sometimes go wrong and it's a problem I've had before in the past. Some things being like sleeves being too tight, this doesn't have that. Sleeves being very plain, this doesn't have that. The back not being interesting enough. This does not have that problem. Also a problem I had was that they would be so long that they would be touching the floor. However, you can see this actually skims my legs mid calf this is not a petite coat this is not for the petite section and being five foot two and finding a coat at this length it's like hitting the absolute coat jackpot so honestly i'm really really pleased with this one i think it's so nice again even though it is a color it is pretty timeless even if you were to do the old button and cinch in at the waist look at that i love a trench coat i just i just think Everybody should have a trench coat in their wardrobe. And this is incredible. Absolutely love it. Can't wait to wear this one. Okay, so final item of item final item of outerwear is this gilet. I got a gilet from HM a few months ago. And I fell in love with it. Does this have pockets? No. Um I got a gilet a couple of months ago. Loved it. Oh, the pockets are here. And then I saw this. And this is a very kind of, I wear my gilet when I go to the supermarket and I wear my gilet when I do sort of little, little things, bits and bobs. And I just saw this with its little, little cinched in waist, waist, waist option. Got it in a size eight, lovely chocolate brown colour. Um, right now it looks like it doesn't do up. If I were to release these, it would. But I would just, <laughs> I just love this, you know? Really, really nice. A gilet is a great layer. It's got a really nice neckline. The one from H&M is very high and it looks really cool, but it's not as practical. It kind of makes you a bit uncomfy. I find it quite hard to drive in. Whereas in this, so I can drive a car. Yeah, not legally, on a provisional, obviously, but I can drive a car. Um, yeah, love it. Honestly, just love it. I think everyone should have a gilet. Before I got a gilet, I was like, mm, I'm not a gilet person. And then I got a gilet and I was like, my gilet is my personality. Have you ever seen that TikTok where she calls it a gillet? And she was like, I don't care what it's called, I'm gonna call it a gillet. And it was like, Bessie, it's just not what it's called though, is it? 
It's like calling an orange an orange. It's just not what it's called. While we're here, and I haven't taken these clothes off, let me show you the two accessories I got. I got this beret. It's brown. Now, my friends always make fun of me because of the amount that I like love a hat. I do think I suit hats, but I haven't quite figured this one out yet, quite clearly. You know, like, do you wear a beret? Like, my hair isn't very good today, so you can't really get the full effect. But, like, do you wear a beret like this? What do you, how do you wear one? Because it's not like this that you're supposed to wear. It's not like that either. Like, I feel like, I don't know. I just don't know. But I also got an orange handbag. Bonjour, je m'appelle Maria J Bloggs. French. I also got this little thin kind of polo neck jumper. I would actually wear this like cropped over some jeans or some trousers or something. This is really, really nice. This is from the Boohoo, I think it's called like Ready for the Future collection. Basically, they use more recyclable materials, sustainable materials to create these pieces. I notice in particular, these uh, pieces from this specific collection are really, really nicely made. I think they've got like a percentage of recyclable materials in or something like that. So heading in the right direction. It's not even particularly exciting, but it's, it's one of my favorite items. I just love it. Quick crop and you can see. So nice, very nice basic layer. Again, this jumper, same collection, really, really nice. Honestly, just such a good basic. I told you I felt like I filled a lot of gaps with this. Now, obviously, when you wear an oversized jumper like this, it doesn't look very good. But again, you know, if you're doing like a little tuck, often tucking these things, my stomach is so pale, don't look at it. Tucking them into like um, your bra, just doing a very rough tuck there kind of gives them a little bit more shape, but having like the length is quite good because then you can wear them with leggings. So I do tend to get jumpers a little bit more oversized. What I really like about this and like what I mentioned about the noticing the slight difference in the quality is that like the neck is a really good neck. It's a very strong neck. The sleeves and the um, the wrists, why did I just forget what wrist was called? Um, they're like notably, like this is very nicely made. If you told me this was a really expensive kind of um, 50 pound jumper, I would believe you. Lovely and soft, really nice. And again, when's this gonna go out of style? It's just not. You see? Good order, good order. Okay, this jumper, which needs to go in the wash straight after I film this video, because I have worn this now, oh my goodness, seven times since I got this order which was like a week ago. I wear a lot of black roll necks. I feel like I really know what I'm looking for in a good black roll neck. I feel like I'm a black roll neck connoisseur. This jumper, the sleeves, look. That is just saying something a little bit different. Really nice chunky material, um, but also not too chunky to tuck in. I've been wearing this out a lot, like just like over with my black jacket over the top, just kind of very casually, not even tucking it in. And it's, honestly, it's just easy, isn't it? And it just looks nice. Definitely needs a wash now. It's got like foundation on the neck and stuff like that. Two pairs of trousers to go. Let's go. Okay, I've saved one of my favorite things of the whole haul until last. These trousers have to be one of my favorite purchases in a long time. I have taken them up obviously because I'm short and trousers come and they look like they've been made for somebody with six foot long legs. Um, but I just honestly love them. Like the fit of them is really nice. High waisted, we don't like any low waist around here. Um, very nice, kind of like tailored trousers, but like slouchy at the same time. Honestly, just really like them. The quality of them is so nice, they're so soft. I wore them to an event with Boohoo. Um, and I said to the girl there, I was like, these trousers, are such nice material, really, really nice. Again, these are from the um, For the Future slash Recyclable collection. Really nice, just love them. And I've gotten so much wear out of them already. I love a wide leg trouser. I just think it's like an easy go-to if you don't wanna wear a pair of jeans. Comfortable, but it looks good. Better than jeans, probably. Right, last trousers. Let's go. Here we have a pair of green flares i saw them i couldn't resist them i said i don't own any green trousers 
let me get some green trousers just in time for St. Patrick's Day if you do not know I am half Irish. These are actually really nice again I took them up um, but they come up a little bit small around here maybe I would have sized up in these I honestly didn't like because the other trousers are an eight and I always wear trousers in an eight I think I maybe should have gotten these in a ten um, but again like the waistband is not tight you can see there's plenty of room for movement in this waistband but it's more here so if you are buying them and you're a bit bigger here then i would maybe suggest sizing up they're fine but yeah if i was buying them again i probably would try them in a 10 and see which i prefer thank you very much for watching i hope you enjoyed as i said i filled so many wardrobe gaps with this haul honestly i'm really pleased with everything I'm really pleased with everything. When do you get a haul that you like everything and you feel like you've really hit some points that you've been trying to hit? Never. I'm impressed. Everything will be linked below um, if you want to shop it. What else is there to say? Discount code. Hope you've enjoyed. See you next time.